Hello, my wonderful friend. Today's video is on 11 things men do that make women melt. Has there ever been a special gal who just melts your heart? Like she gives you butterflies and you think about her all the time and you can't help but smile when you're around her. Is there maybe a gal that you know right now who makes you feel that way? Wouldn't it be cool if you could make her feel the same way? If you gave her butterflies, if you just melted her heart, that would be amazing, right? The truth is this is a really important thing to know how to do if you want a happy, loving, lifelong relationship. Now, the good news is you're about to be a pro because I have 11 things men do that make women melt. And I think you're really going to be surprised by how powerful the simple little things really are so make sure you stay with me until the end of this video because you don't want to miss any of these amazing tips before we dive into these 11 things men do that make women melt make sure you subscribe and ring that notification bell my name is melanie i'm a christian dating coach for men and creator of attracting lasting love academy i am your go-to source to learn how to have a loving lasting relationship without mind games and without drama we're talking your dream relationship so make sure you subscribe and ring that notification bell as we dive in I want to mention two other videos that are also really going to help you with it if you haven't yet seen this video on how to win her heart I'll put a link in the description below and this video on how to make her think about you almost without trying you need to see both of them and there are links in the description below now as I share this list with you of things men do to make women melt there are two things I need you to do. Number one, notice the things that you're already doing, that you're already good at. And I want you to like celebrate those things, okay? Pay attention to those things and like pat yourself on the back. The second thing is pay attention to the things that maybe you don't know how to do or maybe you're not good at yet. One of the most attractive things you can do as a person is look for ways to improve and ways to learn. This, If you haven't seen this video yet, there's a link in the description below for that as well. But we talk there about a growth mindset and how when you are willing to learn and improve, you are insanely attractive. So one, celebrate your wins, celebrate what you're doing right. And two, pay attention to the things you can improve on because those little things will make you an insanely attractive person. With that, let's dive in with the first thing a man does that just makes a woman's heart melt. Number one, is listening to her. Women really connect through talking. And everyone on this planet wants to feel understood, right? We want to feel appreciated. We want to feel like we matter. And when someone listens to us, it makes us feel special. This is especially true when that really attractive man is listening to her. She feels connected to you. She feels like you're really special because a lot of men, a lot of people in general, don't take the time to listen. So if you're the one who's listening to her, holy cow, that is going to melt her heart. In addition to that, when you're listening to her, it helps you get to know her better, helps you understand her better, and you can notice the little things. And when you remember the little things and bring them up randomly, like the name of her dog or her favorite band, or maybe there was a special event and you remembered and asked her about it later, Holy cow, she now feels like she matters to you. She feels special. She feels interesting. And that right there just melts her heart. That is something she's looking for in a partner. So listen to her, pay attention to those little things and bring them up throughout the conversation. And it's really going to melt her heart. Our next thing you can do to melt her heart sounds small, but it's insanely powerful. This is to say her name. As humans, we love to hear our names. It's kind of like our identity, right? And we actually get a chemical reaction, a positive chemical reaction when someone says our name. Now, this is especially true when someone we're attracted to says our name. So you obviously don't want to overdo it. You know, hi, Jessica. How are you, Jessica? Jessica, I was thinking about you, Jessica. Jessica, can I ask you a question, Jessica? She's going to like get really annoyed really, really fast. Instead, just fit her name in casually throughout the conversation 
conversation. When you first see her, when you send her a text, hey, I, when you ask her a question, hey, Jessica, I was wondering, blah, 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 whatever it is, just fit her name in casually as you interact with her. And it's going to make her feel good when she's around you. It's going to give her those butterflies and melt her heart. The next thing men do that makes women melt is when you act masculine and strong. Here's the deal. Women look to men to be protective, to be strong, to make her feel safe. And when a man is masculine, she feels so safe with you. She sees you as her superhero, as that protector, as that man who takes care of her in that way. And that's something that women want. It actually makes women feel more feminine when they're around a masculine man, which really works out because when she's more feminine, you feel more masculine. So it's really a beautiful thing. There is a huge misunderstanding, however, about what it means to be masculine. Our society kind of tries to act like masculinity masculinity is like a oh, type thing. Like, I don't know how to explain it any other way. That was maybe a little embarrassing to do on YouTube, but we're going to go with it. But kind of that like rough and tough and almost a little bit mean, you know, and, and kind of grungy. And the truth is, that is not masculinity at all. And that actually makes women not feel safe with you instead of feel safe with you. So that's not going to serve you at all. Now, some of the ways I teach my clients in my academy to be more masculine, to really just melt her heart and make her insanely attracted to you are things like increasing your confidence. Confident men are masculine men. Pursuing her correctly. When a man pursues a woman correctly, it definitely makes him more masculine. She feels more safe with you. She sees you as like, whoa, he's a confident, strong, masculine man. He's hot. Also, being a good man and a kind man, a gentle man. Despite what a lot of society says, she wants a man who has enough inner strength to be kind and gentle and good. Inner strength is far more more important than outer strength. Not that there's anything wrong with outer strength, but inner strength is more important every time. I also teach you how to use your body language and how you dress to portray yourself as confident and masculine. And that certainly melts her heart because she sees you as a masculine, strong man. By the way, are you ready to stop wasting time on relationships that go nowhere? Are you ready to finally have that special someone that you get to come home to every night. No more coming home to an empty house. No more getting your hopes up only to have them crushed. Instead, you have that special someone to hold forever who loves the real you and who treats you right. If that's you right now, if you are nodding your head yes, then I created my academy exactly for you to teach you step by step how to have that kind of relationship. The relationship you want and the relationship that you deserve. And the best part is I make it simple and fast. The truth is you can keep trying to figure it out on your own. There's a huge room for error in that and high risk. You can just keep guessing and hoping it works or you can let me teach it to you all up front. You can just learn how to be successful up front. You don't have to guess anymore. You can finally just know. So to learn more about my academy and the life changing things you will learn when you join me there. Watch my free masterclass. This is the perfect intro to learn what you'll learn and why it works. And again, it's totally free. To watch this free training, go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. I will also put a link in the description below and a link in the pinned comment. The truth is you owe it to yourself to finally learn what works so you don't have to keep failing and keep getting hurt. You can instead just know how to be successful. So go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. Our next thing men do that makes women melt is when you pursue her. Now we just talked about how pursuing makes you more masculine to a woman. And this, oh my goodness, I can never explain how attractive it is to a woman when a man pursues. 
it does something to her, okay? It makes her see you as strong, as confident, uh, that as you show interest in her, her interest for you grows. And the truth is it helps you feel more confident. It helps you feel more masculine and you deserve to feel that way. Now, a lot of men get nervous about this simply because if you don't know the right way to pursue, there's a lot of room for error and you can fall flat on your face and you don't deserve that. And this is why, again, this is something I teach you in detail how to do in my academy. So do make sure you watch that free masterclass to learn more. Never forget, pursuing a woman is one of the most attractive things a man can do. Just make sure that you're doing it correctly. Our next thing men do that makes women melt is when you defend her, when you support her and stand up for her. Now, obviously in today's society, there's not a lot of cause to like physically like defend her and fight off the bad guy. Although obviously that could happen. But usually what defending her means in today's society is to like stand up for her, support her. Maybe if there's a discussion, back her up. Or if somebody's treating her unkindly, politely, appropriately step in and support and defend her. When a man does something like this holy cow he just became her superhero okay that is how you become her knight in shining armor if she knows that you've got her back if she knows you're there for her holy cow that does something to her that you can't even imagine it most definitely melts her heart the next thing you can do to melt her heart is to treat her with kindness and sensitivity every person on this planet is imperfect. <laughs> That's no surprise to any of us. And we all need some compassion. We all need some sensitivity. We're all a little bit self-conscious about one thing or another. And when she sees that you are a kind man, you are a gentle man, then she knows her heart is safe with you. Now, our next thing you can do to melt her heart goes hand in hand with this. And that is treating others with kindness. When a woman is getting to know you, thinking about maybe a lifelong relationship with you, she's asking what kind of effect you being a part of her life would have on her. So how you treat her family, her friends, how you treat children, she's always wondering how, how it's going to affect her life. And when she sees that you are a kind man and a gentleman to others, not only her, now she knows that you actually are a kind gentleman instead of just treating her well just to get the girl. This is especially true when we're talking about people who are weaker than you. So like, um, children or animals or someone who needs help in any way, when she sees that you treat people with kindness, you treat people well, compassion, holy moly, that's how you melt her heart. Okay, our next way you can melt her heart is a little bit tricky, so pay close attention. This is to give her gifts. However, you need to make sure you're giving her gifts at the right time. Um, a lot of people will think, oh, give her gifts. And so then they will give her gifts before they even really know her or before they've been going out with her for a while. Do not do this. <laughs> if you are giving her gifts before you've been dating for a while, it's going to creep her out. The reason why is because you're acting like there's an emotional closeness that doesn't exist yet because you haven't been dating. So that's my word of caution. However, when you do know her and you have been dating for a while, giving her gifts just out of the blue is adorable. And it doesn't have to be huge. You know, you don't have to give her a yacht. <laughs> it can be like a single rose or it can be her favorite chocolate. Or maybe you're out and about somewhere and she says, oh, that's cute. You could buy it for her, whatever it is. A lot of it depends on how long you've been dating. But those little tiny gifts, especially when you're in like a legit relationship those little gifts are adorable they let her know you're thinking of her and it certainly melts her heart quick question before we go any further are you enjoying this video should i make more videos on how to melt her heart and how to make her feel special if i should comment special in the comments below to let me know your feedback really does help me as i prepare new videos so let me know if this is something you want comment special and if you have any 
questions or comments while you're there, leave those in the comments as well. Okay, the next thing men do that makes women melt is when you set appropriate boundaries. This is another thing that makes her feel safe. This is one of my favorite things to teach you how to do in my academy. It's something most people don't know how to do and aren't doing. So it really makes you stand out. When she sees that you're a man who sets appropriate boundaries, she feels more safe with you. She sees that you are not going to let people take advantage of you. And you're also going to support her and help her not let people take advantage advantage of her. Some we as humans we tend to feel safe with people who set boundaries simply because we know where we stand and boundaries can and always should be set very appropriately and politely. This is definitely something that may sound small, but it 100% makes her feel safe with you, which melts her heart. The next thing men do that makes women melt is when you smile at her. Never underestimate the power of a smile. When someone smiles at us, it actually releases feel-good chemicals and we feel good. It gives us that boost. And if I've said it once, I've said it a million times. People like people who make them feel good. Not only does it make her feel good, but it also helps her see that you're a fun person to be around. Nobody wants to marry someone who's all the time. Like, this just wouldn't really be that fun, would it? <laughs> Instead, she wants someone who can be playful, who can be lighthearted, who can be enjoyable. Now, as kind of a bonus tip, it's especially effective when you smile with your eyes. You get a real connection with someone when they smile with their eyes. Now, this is something you can practice if you want. There's a big difference between just smiling. It's kind of hard for me to do, but I'll try and show you. You can just smile or you can smile with your eyes and your eyes can light up just as much as your smile. Feel free to practice that in the mirror. It's incredibly effective. And the truth is when you do that, you get a boost too. So it's totally a win-win situation. A lot of people think, well, if you're a strong man, you don't smile. That is not true. The strongest men are willing to be vulnerable and that includes smiling. Our next thing men do to make women melt is when you dress hot and take care of yourself. The truth is you like it when she looks hot, right? It makes you feel good. It melts your heart. It gives you butterflies and it makes you smile all over. The same is true for her. When she sees that you look hot, it makes her feel amazing. When I teach you how to skyrocket your physical attraction in my academy, one of the things I teach you is how to dress to empower. This boosts your confidence, makes you feel amazing, which you certainly deserve, and it also also catches her eye and gives her those butterflies and makes her see you as an insanely attractive man. And the truth is taking care of yourself and dressing nice even goes further than that because it shows her that you have enough respect for yourself and for her to want to look nice, to learn how to look nice and then really just rock it. It helps her see that you will want to be attractive for her for the entire relationship instead of just, you know, getting the girl and then not worrying about how attractive you are anymore. Healthy relationships mean you create attractive habits and you maintain them. Thankfully, it does not have to be complicated either. As a matter of fact, something I teach you in my academy is how to dress like a model on a budget. Like it doesn't have to be complicated, but it packs a very powerful punch. On that note, if you are ready to go from unsure to unstoppable in your love life, make sure you watch that free masterclass to learn more about all the amazing things you'll learn when you join me in Attracting Lasting Love Academy. Just go to coachmelanie.com slash masterclass. I will also put a link in the description below. It's time to go from unsure to unstoppable, right? So make sure you watch it now. Thank you so much for joining me in this video. Be sure to subscribe, ring the notification bell, and give me a big thumbs up. I want to hear from you in the comments. Would you like more videos like this? If you would, 
comment special to let me know. Do you have a friend who needs to know how to make a woman's heart melt? Make sure you share this with him. It's going to help him so much, right? And if you don't yet follow me on social media, there are links in the description below. I share exclusive content in my Instagram story, so make sure you especially follow me there. Thank you so much again, my amazing friend, and have an amazing day. There's a little delay in the camera. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> That's a little addicting. Woo! <laughs> okay, it's not as funny to you as it is to me because it's totally delayed. Anyway, moving on.